Hey guys, welcome back again. This is gonna be a quick little update for you regarding Tesla and a recall by NHTSA. Canadians, you don't really have to worry about it. However, you're gonna get the update regardless. Transport Canada did not put out any recalls related to this, but it has to do with the screen just overheating and slowing things down too much. And I'm sure you guys have experienced this. If you have a Tesla and you drive it for roughly about 30 minutes and more, you're gonna touch the screen and it's just baking hot. Now, I don't know if that has to do with the CPU, the cooling, or what is it about it, but it's definitely much hotter than let's say an iPad and using it for like five hours long. This just, I feel like the cooling of the Tesla screens are so bad that there has to be something that is gonna affect the internals eventually. Well, that day has come and a recall has coming out by NHTSA and Tesla, of course, it's gonna conform to that. The screen is so laggy to a point when it gets so hot that the backup camera lags so much when you put it into reverse. And I can see how that becomes dangerous eventually. Imagine you're driving, you're pulling up your camera, nothing pops up and it takes like five seconds. You'll probably get into an accident before the thing pops up. And I've had experiences where the thing was so slow I had to reboot it multiple times. But just the fact that I touched the screen and it's just a baking hot every single time in the winter, in the summer, all the time. It just makes the thing even more leggy than it is. I do have an Intel version of the MCU, so I'm sure that the Intel Atom processor is a lot more cool efficient than let's say the Ryzen processor, and even then it is so hot. So I'm not sure what Tesla is gonna be doing, but a recall has been sent out, and Tesla is gonna be pushing out an update, probably even more future updates to make it even better. And I think there's already one that was already pushed out to try to fix this issue, but a big chance says that this is not gonna fix the issue entirely. I am feeling my screen literally every day and it's still baking hot. Nothing has changed with the updates coming out. So anyways, I will drop the recall in the description or I'll drop it somewhere up here for you guys to check out. But essentially what it says is that their screen is slow and they're gonna be pushing out an update to fix it. So I hopefully that uh, fixes the issue where when you press the screen and you pull it back out and your fingers are smoky. Uh, hopefully that gets resolved soon. So anyways, guys, this should wrap it up for this quick little update. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please smash that subscribe, that bell notification. Once again, this is John. Peace out.